All right, I'm on barbecue review. Today, we're in Hartsville, Alabama. We're uh, got a lot of requests for Holy Smoke barbecue, and uh, hey, you guys said it, and here we are. We're uh, we're out doing some fan favorites today. Me and Mr. Fowler uh, can't come to Decatur without without bringing Alan Fowler with you. But uh, man, you Decatur folks and Hartsville folks, y'all have. Y'all have came out in an army, and uh, you've told us where you want us to go, and here we are. But uh, like I say, folks, before we get started, uh, a little bit by scoring. We score pulled pork, pulled pork only. We do a apples to apples. Uh, we do a high school score, zero to 100. Zero being the worst, 100 being the best. Um, somewhere in the mid-70s is pretty good barbecue, but that's enough about scoring. Um, I think it's a what was it about four dollar sandwich? I don't even I don't even know what <laughs> I didn't even pay attention to what it was. Uh, uh, don't know. Don't know. But anyway, um, they sauce it for you. Uh, I could have got them to not sauce it, but uh, it's got a good smell to it. It smells like it's like it's got plenty of smoke um, and uh, no bark, <laughs> but. Alan's gonna show you what one looks like fully loaded. <laughs> they got nice pickles on them. You folks know I don't do fully loaded. Don't care for pickles. They sauced it, but uh, they didn't put quite enough on there for me. So let's take a taste of this meat and see what this meat tastes like. That meat's got a good flavor. Got good smoke. Um, Oh yeah, man, that's pretty good. <laughs> Might be a reason uh, Decatur folks and Parcel folks say I gotta get to Holy Smokes. Let's put some. Uh, let's put some uh, sauce on this thing and see what we see what we got. Alan said he gotta have a little more sauce too. <laughs> Maybe a little bit. Maybe a little bit. I ain't, I ain't gonna sauce it like you are. <laughs> I gotta say, I've gotta see what it tastes like, boys and girls. Uh, but let's uh, let's give these things a go, Alan. See what you think. Mm, that is another sweet sauce, but that is a good sweet sauce. I think. That's sweet sauce, but it's not a bad sweet sauce. No, it's got some bite to it, got some kick to it. Um, yeah, I'm feeling a little more every time. <laughs> every time I breathe, it's a little harder. Yeah, but, uh, that's not bad at all. Uh, what do you think of the slaw? It's a good slaw. Good slaw. It's, cool. it's a good slaw. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's uh, let's take another bite of this rascal. See where I'm at. Yeah, that's pretty good, folks. Um, that's pretty good barbecue. Um, now, the lady in the back said she saw that I tasted Bob Gibson's white sauce. She said, hey, you got to try my white sauce. Uh, it wouldn't be right to not try this lady's white sauce, especially when they went through the trouble of bringing me out a uh, bringing me out a bottle to try. But let's see what this stuff tastes like. That is an excellent white sauce. Yeah, when you come up here, folks, throw some of that white sauce on top of your on top of your red. See what you think of that. That's uh, that's pretty good. That that does that does that sandwich and justice. And that was kind of a kind of a sweet um, white sauce. Never quite had anything like it. That's uh, but that's good. That's not a bad thing. Um, Alan, where you at on score, brother? That's pretty good barbecue. I agree. But then we go back to the sweet sauce. Yeah. <laughs> In my book, the sweet sauce takes 
it don't take away from the sandwich, but it doesn't enhance the sandwich. I'm gonna say it's an 87 sandwich right there. Okay. Well, me and Alan, we are on the same page because I'm gonna go an 88 sandwich on that one. That's a really good barbecue. That's driving barbecue. Get in your truck. Come on down to Holy Smokes and uh, have yourself a barbecue because this is pretty good stuff. Um, but like I say, that's about all. That's about all we got today. And uh, once again, folks, we appreciate everything you guys do. We appreciate all the great comments and uh, keep them coming. Tell us where to go in your neighborhood. Thank you, folks. Worst fishing show ever.